Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. I wanted to show you in this video how you can convert the voice to text and even transcribe your voice recordings or videos for free. And it is something that uh, I need a lot and um, I wish I knew about these services before, but during my uh, study at school, I needed this so badly, but I was not able to use it. And the premium services out there, they were just really expensive. So today I wanted to show you how you can do it uh, for free. And uh, I'm going to, I'm very excited actually to show you uh, these two services. So first of all, the first one is uh, Google Docs. It's a free service that you can access when you create an account. And uh, if you go into the Google account and open a blank document, so I'm going to create like a voice recording test. All right. I name it this. And one thing I want to make sure that you are aware of is that this service, the first one, only works in Chrome. So make sure that you are using Google Chrome. Uh, we're not going to use any ads on or anything, but this is a service that's provided by Google. And for some reason, which is understandable, they only allow it in inside this uh, Chrome browser. So once you open the file, uh, go to the tools and in here, it's a voice typing option. So click on that and it will bring up a microphone. And once you click on this microphone, it will enable the transcription or voice to text uh, feature for you. And as you see, while you speak, it will transcribe it for you and transfer or exchange the voice to text. So it's a handy service. And since it is free, um, it's very accessible to everyone. You don't have to pay anything to anyone. And um, one more thing is that you will have the option to save it as a document. And it's very nice that you will have all the formatting features in here while you speak and, you know, uh, you can convert it to any type of document, PDF or anything right off the bat. I have to say that it is pretty accurate. Now we were talking about like general stuff and day-to-day uh, -day conversation, but uh, go ahead and give it a challenge by, you know, speaking some technical documents or try to record some text that you would often come across and see how accurate it is. I challenged it with uh, my major, which is like electrical engineering, computer science, and the results are pretty accurate. Uh, I wouldn't say that it doesn't need the correction, but at least you see that once you complete it, um, you have the option to go back and change the, the keywords and everything else. So I believe it's a great uh, option for especially students that, you know, they can access it anywhere. And within the class, you can enable the microphone and it start recording the class for you and transcribing it at the same time. Uh, just one thing I want to mention is that make sure that you use a, a good microphone uh, because the quality is uh, kind of like dependent on the quality of the microphone that you use. And uh, uh, yeah, I would say that's the only thing that I would like to say about uh, using the Google uh, voice to text um, service. So with this one, which was easy, we're ready to learn about the other service. So I would stop it in here and you see that I have the text and I can go back and correct uh, the things that I you know, misspelled or spoke about it and, uh, you know, insert pages, insert images or anything else that you would like. So this is one service that I wanted to show you. The other one is actually, I'm very excited about this one and um, it has a free plan and it has uh, also plans for education, students, teachers, and all of that. But, um, it is very neat and accurate. Uh, I was really surprised. And so when I compared it with Google, uh, the results are pretty close, but sometimes it's more accurate due to the fact that you can train this service. Once you correct it, it will, you know, learn from, from the word or everything else. And you, you have the option to add custom vocabulary to it as well. 
And uh, this is a premium service, but I will uh, provide you with the link in here. That's a referral link, but it will give you and I both uh, one month free of free of uh, service. And even after that, it is free. I will show you about the pricing um, up to a certain uh, minutes that you use it. it it's going to be free. And I believe it would be more than enough for most of us. So you can also install the app on your your mobile and use it in class or during conversation or like uh, I'm going to demonstrate right now, you can do it in the browser as well. So it does record and it does the live transcribe and you have the option to share it uh, with, with others. And uh, like I said, it has options for teams, for education. And uh, let's jump to pricing in here so I can show you the features. So you can record and play back, uh, transcribe in real time, identify speakers. That's great because once, um, once you're in a meeting with multiple people, they start speaking and you would want it to know who was, who was that person later when you read the text. And it does automatically. I'm going to show it to you. So generate summary of keywords and board count. Uh, search by keywords. You can search um, the, the results, edit and highlight, share and collaborate with groups. Um, you know, even you can import audio and video. It doesn't mean that you have to record it right there. If you have a recording of the video or audio uh, that you would like to transcribe, you can import it to the service and it does it for you. And uh, obviously you can export audio uh, and text um, in different formats. I'm going to show you all of that. Synchronize Zoom cloud recording. So if you use Zoom as your service, it does actually um, do it on the background and record it and transcribe it for you. And this is the main difference that I would like to show you in here. So as a free account, you can use it for 600 minutes a month. And I believe that's more than enough for most of us. But uh, you see that you get all of the things that the premium and teams are getting. And I, I believe this is pretty sweet. And, um, and once you see how effective and productive this suit is, you're going to use it every single day. And for the premium features, uh, you will have custom vocabulary, Dropbox integration, um, you know, playback speeds and silence, bulk export and all of that. And uh, so yeah, give it a try. Now I'm going to show you how you can use it in here. So uh, go ahead and use the link in the description in the video if you wanted to try the premium for one month you can use that link and uh, once you do that log into the system so I'll, i already did i'm going to log in and show you around it's going to show like a, a little demonstration that um how we can make the recording but this is the window that you would like to that you come across um this is the window that you see once you log in and you you see that um, there's a, my conversations and then shared with me if somebody else uh, shared with you and it's it's a great option for students because you can create groups with for different classes and uh, have your team members record one class and you record the other one and share it with with each other this way saving the 600 minute a month and uh, that would be great. Also, you can create folders for different classes or different uh, meetings that you have if you're a professional working in the industry you wanted to uh, separate the meetings that you are in. And since they're searchable, you have the option to go, you know, and find the ones that you have if you are uh, someone that goes into a lot of meetings. So on the right hand, it, it shows clearly how to start a recording and also import audio and video if you have some recording there. So without further ado, let me actually create a YouTube folder. So I know that it is for YouTube and you see that you're automatically uh, browsed into that, that folder right in here. So I would start recording and you need to allow the microphone to kind of like uh, start recording your voice and I love this one because it automatically gives you the, you know, timestamp in here and also the count of the minutes you have. And in, down in here, you see that you have the option to pause the recording or stop it once you're done. And uh, you see that the recording in here, the transcription are very accurate. 
and uh, if I pause like right now it just automatically goes to another paragraph assuming that you have spoken and you're waiting for someone else and even if you're talking and it goes to some other uh, timestamp it will it will adjust it for you so in here you can give it a sample like uh, YouTube transcribe test in here and uh, one thing that I love about this is that you have the option to actually let me pause it for one moment all right so now it is paused and you have the option to select let's say one portion of this and highlight it okay so maybe these are the important parts of the meeting that you are working um, and you wanted to have option to those specific sections that you have uh, in your recording also you can uh, import images from this let's say um, I would this image in here that I would import it and you know you can add or remove other uh, file formats as well so this is handy and on the left side you can have the option to share with anyone through a link you can create a link and you can also specify at what time you would like them to um to kind of have the have the recording or the transcription with so this is great and uh let's see go what we see in here we have the account settings uh earn um refer and earn uh contact support and all of that so i think it's uh, good for a, a demonstration let me stop it so we can go and see what happens next so as you see, the YouTube folder now has a recording and you see in here it's in processing. So it's processing it, it shows how many pictures are there and uh, how long it was, was that recording. So if I open this, we do this playback. You see that, uh, first of all, it has created a summary of the keywords. I love this because, because you would like to know what the conversation what was the gist of conversation and by looking at it you see that oh okay so these were these were the mm, majority of the keywords so you get a quick understanding and grasp of what was the meeting about before going there all right so if you browse there you see that it has one one identifying one because it's, it's still in processing uh it's not done yet but uh one important thing is that you can click on this and specify who was that person okay it automatically verifies that person who was that and because it, it was only one speaker it just shows that person but the system is smart to identify that everywhere else in the system if that person has spoken they were assigned to that and in here you can add let's say speaker two i would say john okay i would uh I can add John in here and mind you that we were we were doing this in the middle of the transcription before it was it was completed so uh, we caused the system to show a little error but if you play back kind of like uh, start recording your voice and I love this one because it automatically gives you the you know timestamp in here you see that it syncs the voice with the text. I, I believe this is pretty sweet. Yeah, so that was, I don't want to make this video too long, but you get the idea. And the last part I wanted to show you is that you can export this text to, uh, you know, PDF. You can include speaker names, remove branding, unexport, which is uh, uh, a premium service, clipboard, uh, uh, SRT even for videos. And let's see what we have you can rematch speakers export audio so if I do that it will give me the option to uh, export the audio as well so I hope you like this and uh, you enjoy this service as much as I do and uh, let me know what you think about it if you like this video please subscribe and share it with your friends thank you very much and and have a great day